wannabe streamer who tends to be male but occasionally can be a depressed female looking for anything. Is that me? Is, is that not the And today we got worst types of kids in high school featuring Birdie Official. This is an old offending everyone's reaction. You know how those get. You know what I'm saying? I don't got nothing else really to say. Are the worst types of kids in high school? Oh. Who are the worst types of kids in high school? Talk to me. Is it the plastics, also known as basic bitches, armed with a frappuccino, iPhone, Gucci handbag, and Lululemon yoga pants that makes her ass look way too big? Their ultimate goal is to be a housewife with a retirement plan of selling their used tissues on OnlyFans. Is it the wannabe influencer, always making TikToks, especially in places they don't supposed to be filming in? We'll always remind you that one video. Did I have? Did I? You know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? I'm not even the biggest nigga to come from my school, bro. Oh God, I don't know if y'all know who this is. I don't know if y'all know who this is, but this YouTuber went to my high school, bro. Y'all know who this is? Y'all know who this is? Oh, they quit. Let's go, they quit. I'm playing, I'm playing. My apartment tour, I actually kind of want to see how rich this motherfucker got, bro. So I can like, you know, compare myself and feel like shit. Damn, I just want to see like the rooms. Here we have. Ah, see, stairs. You know a motherfucking making bread when their crib got stairs and, and it. You know. Can we get a house tour? Absolutely not. My shit ain't set up. Video that got 3 million views when they average 200 on every other. Has given up school and all future job prospects in the hopes of getting railed in an influencer mansion. You're gonna have hey, to yo. take one if you want to make it. <laughs> I love it when you cry. Was that the role that Birdie played in the video, bruh? What the fuck? I can't even get mad, though. Cause in my animation career, I've played a total of three gay niggas in other people's animations. So I don't know why that's a role that I keep getting casted. I don't know why that's a role that keeps getting given to me, but I played a gay nigga in Don in a Don video, in a Birdo video, and in some other video, I just don't fucking remember. I don't, I don't know why that's a character that niggas keep assigning to me. Is it f boys born with the perfect jawline? Get all their advice from Andrew Tate. Vocab consists of did you smash, bro, and no homo? If they made a tier list, it would be men, house cat, then women. Is it fake depressed people? The people that base their is it fake depressed people? The people that base their identity on one Billie Eilish song. Self diagnosed with a mental illness, threatens to kill themselves for attention, can't go to therapy because no one understands them. Compares their life to actual underprivileged people. Spaghetti again, mom? Jesus, I feel like this is Ukraine. Is it the girl that you're pretty <laughs> sure is pregnant you know the girl that all of a sudden i've never seen a pregnant girl in my high school i i that i knew there was a girl that was pregnant but i never seen it i never seen it starts wearing a hoodie even though however however i'm a yeah I'm, I'm in a yapping mood today i don't know what it is bro there was this one time there was this one time in my school right i feel like i could talk about it because i haven't gone to school for, for fucking ever bro bro there was like um Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. I ain't signed no NDA. It was this one time Lil Pump and Smoke Perp did a show. Actually, fuck it, I don't care. Lil Pump and Smoke Perp did a show in Austin, right? Show in Austin. Now, I'm not going to say which one, but there was a rumor going around in my school that a girl gave one of them head. And that girl got like mad clout in the school for it, bro. She was crazy. She was crazy, bro. That is like the closest. That is the closest, though, that I've seen. No, it's 82 shit. degrees outside. You're not sure if she has a baby bum or if she's been pounding some KFC recently. Is it weebs? Kids who feverishly masturbate to Japanese culture. They insist they've never heard of hentai when we all know they have a topless photo of Starfire in the room. You'll catch these guys, Naruto, running to class, pretending to use a sword, and... And then complaining that, like, women don't like them because they like anime. It's like, no... They don't like you because you're strange. Pumping their Zuko body pillow during stuff. Niggas will do shit like this and wonder why they don't get bitches. The shit is absolutely insane. How old were they? Oh, fuck, bro, I ain't going. Ugh. Is it this Snoop Dogs? Always high on something, speaks in metaphors, relaxed to the point of narcolepsy. You always catch them vaping in places they aren't supposed to. The bathroom, the hallway, girls' locker room. <sighs> Damn titties be fire. Now don't confuse these people with pill heads who started- This is you? I have never smoked a day in my life. Vaping in middle school and have gradually escalated to harder drugs. Weed is like a hand job to them. If it's the only thing offered, they'll take it. But they're really looking for something that'll blow their minds. Is it Miss Daddy Issues? Always comes to school with a different hair color. Typically has tattoos and piercings. Only dates guys who are out of prison or on their way there. And most importantly, willing to do anal by the second date. Is it cop- Whoa. 
cops pretending to be students to bust international drug crimes. You know the guys that transfer to your school midway through the year are clearly in their- Yo-Yo is a fence demon. Mid thirties and always ask, "Where's the party at?" You can tell it's them because they always use. Oh, thumbnail! Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Cops or on the. Appreciate there. you. And w, most importantly, w, w. Will Oh my God! Such a great thumbnail. Oh my God! Do anal by the second date. Is it? Yep. Yep. Pre that wasn't good. That wasn't good. Let me dry off my hands. Fuck. I can't. Fuck, I keep, all right, I keep fucking, my hands are Cops pretending but. to be students to bust international drug crimes. You know the guys that transfer to your school midway through the year are clearly in their mid-30s and always ask, where's the party at? You can tell it's them because they always use outdated slang like this party is dope and you guys don't use horse tranquilizers? <gasps> Surprise Pikachu face. Is it that one <laughs> Asian girl? You know the chick that would normally be a six, but she comes off as a nine because she seems exotic? Now sure, if you put your hand over her face, she has the body of a 12-year-old boy, but you're Catholic, so... You're probably into that. Is it the foreign yeah. exchange student? Speaking of exotic, now we have someone who doesn't even speak the language. Did donde esta el condom? I'm sorry, I don't speak your ooga booga language. Now, do you want this green card or not? Is it Elon Musk fanboys? Always saying, no, this billionaire's different. He really cares about me and the environment. Oh now, sure, God, he barely bro. pays any taxes. Nigga, no cat. Also, Majin W. Shout out by the girl. Um, no fucking cat, bro. There was this one time I was at the cafe. I go to a cafe like every day to like work, right? Now, I live in Austin. If Elon, Elon could not go celibate in Austin, Texas, because he would not be able to walk down the street without a nigga wanting to double grip pepper grind his shit, bro. Niggas cannot keep Elon's dick out of his mouth where I live, bro. I swear to God. So I'm at a cafe, right? And um, the barista is like talking to this dude. They're talking about billionaires, right? Now they're talking about, I think, oh, what's the other nigga's name? The small one, Jeff Bezos. Yeah, he's talking, they're talking about Jeff Bezos, right? And the, the other guy's talking about Elon. Cause like, I think, no, I don't remember, bro. No, it was Mark Zuckerberg and Jeff Bezos. They, they wanted to let like, box or something. I remember when that was like a thing. And um, the guy comes and he's like, oh, but Elon would drop both of them. Let me pull up a picture really quickly, bro. This is Jeff Bezos, and this is Elon Musk. I've never seen someone built like a, <gasps> like that's his body type. You know, you got endomorphic and ectomorphic. His body type is <gasps> like, bro, that shit is insane. What the f He built like a Cybertron. <laughs> Yo, no fucking cap. That nigga is built like a cyber truck, bro. This accepts government subsidies and supports political candidates who don't believe in climate change or queers, but that doesn't matter because he's an advocate for free speech. That's why he bans journalists that make critical remarks about him. That's freedom to say, I don't want to hear you speak. Is it the kid that wishes he was black? Wear swag hat, drops the hard R, comes to school with a gun that he barely knows how to use. Billy, no! Oh! Well, shit. At least I got me some prison cred. Is it? So Birdie has played a nigga that got fucked and a, a, a school ooter. Got the diehard sports fan. The guy who insults you for liking Star Wars, yet has an entire room dedicated to sweaty men. Sports fanatics basically fantasize about something they're not. A rich, athletic, probably black guy who occasionally smashes an Armenian pig. Is it the two gay kids who keep trying to hook up because they're gay, but they keep telling you just because we're gay doesn't mean we're going to be into each other, but then they eventually hook up at the end of the year? <laughs> Those queers make me so happy. Is it the wannabe streamer who tends to be male, but occasionally can be a depressed female looking for anything? Is that me? Is, is, am I the, is, is this me? To give her an identity. They like to brag how they're an affiliate earning money, yet every time you turn them on, they just have three viewers. Like, bitch, the only one sending you donos is your mom who just wants you out of the house. Is it the school shooter who says ominous things when he's bullied, like, one day you'll be sorry. Doodles pics of him burying classmates. Has a mother who hey, claims yo. her child is an angel and a father who beats him for, quote, looking too queer. Make sure to give this kid some snacks. That way, when he goes postal, he'll have a sweet memory of you. Is it the guy that takes sports way too seriously? Your ass is Talk mine, you. Billy. Chill, Tommy. It's just. So Birdie has gotten fucked, shot a nigga, and has said, your ass is mine. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. I want to see the Google Doc that had his lines on it. No cap. Badminton. That's what losers say. Is it the average white boy who wants to kill himself? You know, the kid that. 
that's ironic considering that was Lil Peep. That was, yeah, uh, rest in peace, though. Doesn't excel in anything and is just in the middle of the pack. Dreams is smashing dimes at his school, but biggest fear is talking to them. Something tells me there's a few of them watching this video right now. And my advice to them would be killing yourself is never the answer. Unless you're under 5'6", then might as well click Damn. that restart button. Is it the letter kids? You know, the LGBTQ7 Batman symbol? The ones that always preach tolerance as they bully anyone that disagrees with them. Say Caitlyn Jenner's a hero, or I'm flagging all your TikTok content. Is it thoughts? Girls who always sleep around, wear hoop earrings, crop tops, ripped jeans. Vocab primarily consists of saying low-key and dead ass. These chicks are basically spicy hot Cheetos. You'll get the urge to put one in your mouth, but shortly after, you'll be covered in a fiery itch. Is <laughs> Crazy. Did the ugly girl who claims men objectify her always complaining that men eye rape her when any guy would rather get an extra circumcision than stick it in her bear trap? I'm talking about you, Becky, you fat slut. So there you have it, all the worst kids in high school. Special thanks to Birdie for collabing on this one. And just remember, Ludwig loves it when you beg. Oh, yeah. Mm. That nigga, yo, Birdie, get some help, bro. Bird, Birdie, fight back, bro. No cap, cause that's a that's a that's a crazy collab, bro. But hey, man, that was my reaction. The worst types of kids in high school, featuring Birdie. All that being said, um, don't really got nothing else to say. So I'll catch y'all next one. Peace.